Yes, yes, welcome to another episode, another session with us, Cloud9 Studios. My name is Elijah. I have with me the beautiful Tommy Sin here. Tommy, are you floating? Yes, I'm floating. You're floating. Welcome to Elijah. Gist on the Cloud. Okay, so I want to ask, what is your favorite Nigerian high life music? Uh, my favorite Nigerian high life music would be Baby Me Joe or Jekka Joma Badu by Victor Laya. That's Baby Joe. Yeah. yeah. What's yours? Um, so I actually love, love, love King Sonia Day. I love his songs because I grew up listening to King Guess Sonia one. Day. Yeah, so I love um, Appreciation, Merciful God, and songs like that. But for for today's I Life music, I would actually say Flavor. I love Flavor, Flavor songs. Flavor, Flavor. That's crazy. As you said, Appreciation, the songs were playing in my head, <laughs> and that's crazy. That's crazy. Um, Elijah. That's my name. In your opinion, how do you think um, I Life influenced today's Afrobeats? Well, uh, High Life is such an integral part of the African community. Mm -hmm. First off, it has been embedded into the culture so much so that today's Afrobeats would not even exist without the high life components being there or i would say it won't be complete without the high life component yeah. being there because from i don't want to go so deep into the way back but from the way back we we could see the trends coming in the um instrumentations the beats that were infused the originality of the beats to african instruments um the four second count the um the kind of messages that are passed across in high life music the themes mm -hmm. of joy happiness you know yeah. social communism the fact that you talk about things that are happening in the community yeah so now narrating that to today's afrobeats is almost the same thing because we see artists using the music to talk about important things things that really matter because it's different if you now come and start doing interviews an interview you watch the interview the interview will end but now they're putting it on the songs just as the former the old artists used to put the issues that were important on their songs so you get to listen to it over and over again and it's crazy because those old songs you listen to them now and some of the issues are still valid mm -hmm. that's the power that music has that's the power that afrobeat has and it is so african it's something that we own so it is for us made by us so yeah. i feel that's that's the way that um high life has come into play to influence and shape the narrative of afrobeats Afro today yeah. what do you think what do you think yeah i also feel like um high life actually played a very major role right? in today's afrobeats like all of it every um single thing every single element that high life has actually infused into today's afrobeats into right. what we have as Af afrobeats today right so we could say that afrobeats should say thank you to high life yes to some extent say that. Yeah, 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 yeah yeah okay so um i know your favorite Af high life um song Mm -hmm. But I'm curious, uh, what's your favorite thing about Afrobeats today? Um, so my favorite thing about Afrobeats today is the um, the fun and upbeat energetic melody, the tempo. Yeah. Like it's almost impossible for you not to dance. That's just one thing about Afrobeats. You listen to Afrobeats anyway and you just want to actually move your body. Uh, yeah, that's true. That's true. That's true. How about you? Me, I like the fact that it's become one of the biggest exports in africa now mm -hmm. it's the economy has just gone up shut up so much um and we have most of the nigerian acts now dominating globally not just in nigeria not just in africa mm -hmm. we are now a force to reckon with and i think that has been the goal right from the jump that's why a lot of people that came before us did a lot of things that they did and we are reaping the fruits of their labor and we say thank yeah. you to them yeah, that's why I love it now. So happy people. Thank you guys for sticking with us on this episode of Gist on Cloud. Thank you guys for floating with us. And now it's time to float to another place.
go tell them bye bye now. No go tell them. Tell them bye bye now. Bye guys. <laughs>